you in Jesus' name. We take the masks off, Lord, and yeah, we'll let people see what we're really like. We'll share our testimonies of failure. Why? Because greater is he that's in me than any failure I've had. And when you're breaking us and melting us and molding us, Lord, it's always so that you can fill us afresh. When you're causing us to de-rig churches and fish from a new side on a new day, Lord, because you've come in a different way, Lord, we're just going to do it. And if we get it wrong, Lord, we can put it back. Let that grace appear, Lord, where we'll try you, take you at your word, even if it's just come, even if it's just change, even if it's just shift. Lord, we're just going to do it. We've just got that raw faith right now to just change, Lord, because it's a new day. And Lord, where we're being, where we're going through that middle and we're facing these challenges and obstacles, Lord, I ask for grace and strength to come. Just like Peter, you may offer one thing, but you'll come to us where we are and meet us at our need and give us the grace to go higher. Grace to go deeper into your love. Grace to go deeper into the community. Grace to touch lives. Jesus. Bring us to that place where we are at total peace and rest in not being able to do anything. Anything, Lord. You don't even need what we bring to the party because you've already prepared it. You've already got the whole meal, just like the pastor, just like your wedding betrothal meal on the part on the day of, 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 of um, Passover, Lord. You'd already prepared it all. They went into that upper room and it was already laid out. Yeah, we don't need what you're doing, guys. I, I, the Father's already laid it out. And Father, in the brokenness. And, and, and in the pain and in, and, in, and in the trauma, Father, of everything that's been going on, I ask, Lord, that you begin to rekindle the dreams. Lord, Father, love will outrun shame, but Lord, I pray, let, let those suffering in these areas catch up. Have that encounter with you. Be willing to surrender all and just let you come have your way. Release it, Holy Spirit, I ask. Release it, I pray. Deal with the pain. Deal with the trauma. Deal with, with, the, with the suffering of this, your, your body in this place, Lord. In this city. From whatever church it is, Lord. Come and meet the needs. Come and break through. Come and mould us back together around, around a meal, Lord. So we're ready. So we're prepared. So we're willing just to wait for you to come. Wait for the outpouring of the sevenfold spirit of the Lord in this day. To wait for you. Heaven's champions are in this room. And Father, I pray that wherever they are now, they'll come forth into that place where they're ready on the day of your power to go from timidity of a campfire to before thousands of people on the day your fire is released. Do it, Lord. Hasten the day of our filling, Lord. Hasten the day when this place reverberates to the sound of praise of many nations. Do it, Lord, I pray. Wow. Do it, Lord. Where this place, GBG Mission, Oikos Fellowship, resounds to the praise of many nations. Do it, Lord. Do it, Lord. Holy Spirit, come. Holy Spirit, come all over this room, Lord. We, we just, we're just in that restoration process tonight of, of where you come, where you'll set us free, where you'll bring us to that place of encounter with you afresh. Lord, where we're restored. Where we're restored. That so you'll take the masks off us, the glasses that hide our true sight, Lord.
follow where we pulled back and kept our distance from you. Just like Peter did around the campfire, Lord. You want to bring us right up to the breakfast fire, face to face with you. Cheek to cheek and lip to lip, Lord. Father, we come. I'm coming back to the heart of worship and it's all about you. It's all about you, Jesus. Coming back to the heart of intimacy. Coming back to the heart of relationship with you. Coming back to this place where we're no longer defeated by shame. No longer defeated by pain. No longer defeated by our desperation to meet you. But cheek to cheek. Back into you face to face. Holy Spirit, come. Come. In sitting rooms and in houses and on cars where this message is heard, Lord, in trains and automobiles, on planes, Lord, visit, I pray. Visit that this message of restoration of what God will do with heaven's champions to see them released, Lord, let it go out all over this place. Whatever we're trapped in and whatever we're, we're caught up in, whatever's holding us bondage of, I pray we release right now in Jesus' name. That hope would be restored. That that desperation, Peter, Peter said that, that it's like, I will not, it's exactly the spirit of Jacob. I'm not going to let you go until you bless me. Peter's there, I'm not going to let you go until you release this shame. I'm not going to let you go, Jesus, until I've come into my destiny. I'm not going to let you go, Lord. I'm not going to let you tell me the fullness of everything you want on the cross. I'm not going to let you go until I totally live out of greater is he that is in me. So I totally live out of that I'm seated in heavenly places with Christ Jesus. I totally believe it is finished. It's over. It's done. It's sealed. It's under the blood and I'm free. Come Lord Jesus. Come on, Lord Jesus, pour out your spirit afresh on this Friday night, Lord. Pour it out. Set us up for the weekend, Lord. Just pour it out. Overflow into Saturday. Overflow into Sunday, Lord. Overflow into Monday. 